Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I've got my 2017 Thanksgiving manicure. I've started off with Nailtex Formula 2 as my base coat, and I'm using the OPI It's a Piece of Cake today as my base color, and I've topped it off with Posh Top Coat. I'm going to be using my Starry Starry Stamper from Born Pretty and my Born Pretty Gold Polish and BMH13. BMH12 and BMH11 and today I think I'm using my clear jelly scraper so I'm just using different images off of all of all three of these plates on all of my nails I am doing both hands but I'm not going to show you my stamping on my short nails hand today but I'm just plopping these little images down in gold and the manicure ends up looking really cute. I really did like it. Um, but as you'll see here in a little while, I don't leave it alone. The gold just wasn't popping off of there enough for me. So there will be more. So this might be a little bit of a longer video. Um, <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I'm just thankful to have friends that don't mind. <laughs> And I had had someone ask me about placement for, um, you know, using a stamper that's not a clear stamper. So while I'm stamping, I'm just going to rattle and talk and, and, and all that. Um, it was Jennifer Hogan. She had asked if, the, if I had any tips on lining up, you know, sticky stampers that aren't clear. And I figured we might as well use today as, a, as an example of that since I am using you know my other stamper and here I am shrinking the image by pinching the stamper and that one looks long and wonky nope not gonna work so I'm gonna clean that one off and we're gonna attempt this one again clean that plate so I get a good image pickup this one's going on my pinky nail so I need it to be just a little smaller I'm gonna pinch it again there we go. Okay, I can live with that. That'll work. Um, it is very tricky to line up these images, but I hold my nail over the image and just hope for the best. And for the most part, it works out. Um, if you put clear top coat on your nails, you know, over your basic color, then it works really easy that you can, you know, if you're really not happy with the placement of it, you can, you know, rub it real quick with some um, nail polish remover and get the image up and, and go at it again. So here they are, all the gold beautiful images. And really it does look just fine like that. And this one's got all the pies and, you know, the turkey and some leaves and a pilgrim's hat, you know. So I did mix it totally up on all of them. And here's what they looked like, because I thought I was done, so I took swatch photos. And, you know, they look really cute, but I can't leave it alone. So I'm gonna go in with this MDU chocolate and I'm gonna stamp the same images. Now I'm gonna try to use my clear stamper and it's not like in these plates as well. I don't know if my stamper needs to be cleaned, but it doesn't pick up all of the image really well. But in this instance, it really worked out because I really wanted a lot of that gold to show through anyway. So I'm just going back over all of these images, blank, 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 trying to get, you know, Trying to get a little definition or layering going on. Yeah, I didn't like that one. Let's do that one again. That image is really finely etched. It's a very, um, it's got fine lines in it. So uh, I was having a little trouble with it. So we're going to give that one one more go. And there we go. Like I said, it's not picking up all of the image. And I really like that this time because I was hesitant about messing with this. I didn't want to cover up the gold. So I think it worked out just great. And I then got that brush all wonky because I crammed it down in the bottle all crazy. And here we go with another one. And that one really didn't pick up very much of it. So I'm trying to pick up just a little bit more of it to see if I can get some more of it on my nail. Nope, not going to work. So we're just going to move on. Um, let's see what's next. Oh, I'm going to do some more shrinking. We're going to do that little acorn again. I 
think it's the acorn. Yes. Pinch it, pick it up. Very nice. I'm liking it. We're going to keep it. And this was really tricky to shrink an image because you never shrink them exactly the same size. But it worked out. So cheers, cheers to the acorn. I'm going to seal this one in with some posh top coat. Seal that design in for the Thanksgiving holiday. I just hope it makes it to Thanksgiving because I am recording this on Sunday. <laughs> so there we go. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think about this one. If you liked it just gold or if you did like the double stamping. Here's my swatch photos. I hope you enjoyed this one. I appreciate you dropping in and watching. And that is all I have for today. Until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.